So the first step in your Greek frappe on nitro is to mix the Nescafe instant coffee with some sugar. I'm doing a heaping spoonful of each. Feel free to use regular sugar or brown sugar. I pour in some warm water and mix the two thoroughly. In the next step, I'll pour the coffee into the nitro brew kettle, properly lid the kettle, turn on the compressor, 45 maximum PSI, and then I'll push the kettle into the charger. This step, as you know, just takes a few moments. After the compressor shuts off automatically, You'll shake the kettle with both hands on the kettle itself for 5 to 10 seconds. We're going to dispense the coffee upside down and I'm going to hold the trigger until everything comes out. Look at that froth. Add ice and milk to taste. And there you have it, a homemade Greek frappe on nitro with the nitro brew kettle system. How about some homemade whipped cream to go on top? Pour heavy whipping cream into the nitro brew kettle and repeat the steps. You're not going to need a lot of whipping cream in the kettle. Charge like normal and be prepared to shake the kettle for much longer than a regular beverage. Be sure to vent the pressure from the kettle in an upright position before removing the lid to access your whipped cream.